So you have this, you know, young woman driving her car, you know, in the middle of a neighborhood and you're going to have this crazy individual. And that's the best way I can call him not to say something else. He will come out just harassing the young woman about her car and where she's parked on a public street. Mind you, let's roll that clip. Excuse me. What, what did you say now? Yeah, you just I'm doing drugs out of where? Oh, okay. Wait for the cops. Yeah, he won't let cops. me leave. Wait for the cops and we'll you talk with him. Man? Back up and park it. You see this man? Yes, back he up and park it. Me? You hit get me, that's way. assault. Then get out the way. You will get be in court. Way. You will be in jail. Why are you in front of my car? Why are you trying to run me over? Well, I'm in the middle of the street. Get out of the way. Back Why up. Why are you the in way. the middle of the street? Back up. <laughs> okay, now it's assault. Now I'm calling the cops 911. They're on their way. Call them. I am. Why are you Third in front of my car, in row, sir? Dear. Nah. Why are you in front of my car? No. Because it's a free public street. Okay. So exactly. Back it up, bitch. You said it's free public, so why yeah, can't so I get park out of right my here? house? Why? Get away. You're blocking my mailbox. I'll, get the park I'm nowhere anywhere near your mailbox. Y'all you see his mailbox? I'm nowhere yeah. near his mailbox. Excuse me. So I got something to show the, show the cop. Thank you. Well, wonderful you are. Thank you. If you run my foot over, I will. Excuse you. Get away from my no. car. You're harassing me. This is oh, harassment. no. Please You're get away harass. from my car. No, you you, you are bitch. harassing me. No, you hit me, you fucking cunt. Oh, wow. Look at this. You hit me. Can Look you at get, this. Look at this. You hit me. Can you me. get away? You just hit. That's assault. Can you Stop. get away from my car? No, you just hit me. Can you get away from my car? No. You fucking loser. Can you You're get dead away meat, from bitch. my car? You are dead. Thank you. Don't park here. So this is nothing but a, a male Karen. I don't know. Y'all want some people is calling them Kevin's Brad's, whatever you want to call them. But did you see this fool? First he said that she's dealing drugs. Now, you know, good. Well, when, when they sit up there and try to claim that a black person is dealing drugs, you already know what you're dealing with. You're dealing with a straight up racist period. Okay. Ain't nobody a bigger drug dealer than people that look like him, please legal and illegal drug dealers. Don't you ever let them come up to you and tell you about anything about some drug dealing. We have never gotten on that level of drug dealing like people that look like him. Then this fool is coming up to the to the sister and, and, and putting the camera at her and then she trying to move along by her business. You hit me. Ain't nobody hit you. But that's what they do. They sit up here and act like they, they the victims. They start things with you and then they're the victims all of a sudden. I had made a video a while back actually on my website called the aggressive victim mentality. And that's what they do. They sit up there and start things with people and then people even say something or maybe they even actually retaliate and all of a sudden they're the victim, but they the one that started it. That's why I say the aggressive victim mentality. That's what they practice all the time. You get what I'm saying? Because he feel like he got his right and his privilege to block you in the street, to tell you where to park on a public street. She was nowhere in front of his mailbox. It's not like the male people was coming at that moment or whatever. That's just what they do like to harass people. And it's, it's very annoying. That's why I love to see brothers and sisters start roasting them or dealing with them because they deserve every bit of that smoke. And in these videos, people are getting sick and tired of that. And they, they seeing it. So they say, Oh, I can't wait till one of them starts up with me. I wish they would. That's the attitude that a lot of people are starting to have now that I wish they would attitude. And that's a good attitude to have because the problem is that we have been allowing them to do this for too long without checking them. Because I always tell us this, if you start treating them like you, we treat each other, they'll quit all that. Cause you know, getting well, there was a brother just doing that. We wouldn't put up with that. You know, we wouldn't put up with that in a way, shape or form. If it was a woman doing that to we, each other, like I say, no matter where we from, we got so much smoke for each other. But when it comes to dealing with people like this guy, we, we like, oh, well, sir. And this and that, forget us, sir. I'm gonna treat you no different. No, actually I'm gonna treat you definitely different because people in my community don't treat me that way. I haven't had nobody black do that to me. 
harass me, stop me from leaving. But we see people like him do it all the time. I know it was funny to her in which it is funny because it's ridiculous. That's why it's so funny. But these people are living in a twilight zone. And ever since the situation with the um, coronavirus, man, we've been really seeing all these videos come out time after time after time. And yes, we're going to highlight this because this is a reality and it's on the internet. And that's what we talk about different, you know, videos on this particular channel for entertainment and definitely uh, internet videos. But leave me a comment. Let me know what thing about this crazy guy blocking this young woman claiming she dealing drugs, no kind of uh, proof of that. And then claiming she hit him with the car. She didn't do that at all. That was all on video, but these people are crazy as hell.